If you've seen a giant spike in direct traffic to your website through Google Analytics or another analytics platform and you're not sure where it's coming from, it's very possible that it's from Google Discover, which is a really fantastic service from Google where they send traffic from the Discover or the Google app on people's phones directly to relevant articles on your site. And it's very easy to check if you have Google Search Console already set up whether your traffic is coming from Discover. Because again, oftentimes Discover traffic just shows up as direct in your analytics, so you don't see it there. So what you wanna do is go to your Search Console, and I'm here from my site, the Bay Area Telegraph, that gets a fair amount of Discover traffic. Now I'm on just the Overview tab here, and what I wanna do is go to the Discover tab. So we've got search results, which is where you find your traditional search data. And then if we go to discover, you can see some of your discover traffic in here. And if you don't see a discover tab, that means your site is not yet getting discover traffic. Now keep in mind that these are delayed by about usually 48 hours. So if you're seeing a big spike, you'll have to check back probably two to three days later to actually see the data. So if you don't see anything in there or you don't even see a Discover tab but you're getting a bunch of traffic, you might have just broken into Discover and you just need to give it a couple days to see it. But once you're in there, you can take a look at your Discover traffic. You can sort it the same way you would from you know, any other uh, Google traffic in there. And you can even go down and see the specific pages that are getting those Discover clicks. So we can take a look through there. We can also take a look at the countries that are driving that. So we can get a geo-targeted thing. United States is the biggest driver there. Discover appearance, we can see exactly what kinds of stories are getting picked up. And then the dates, we can break down each day what we got and over the time period we're looking at. Also useful to look at the click-through rate for individual stories. So say I wanna go in here and I wanna see what my click-through rate is, it's 10% on this one's probably why they're promoting it fairly heavily in there, um, and I can go and, and analyze some of that traffic. So that's the, uh, the basic process to check your Google Discover traffic there in Search Console. And um, if you found this helpful or you want to build your Discover traffic, I've partnered with Tony Hill and Jesse Cunningham, two really amazing people in the Discover space, to create a course and community showing you how to ignite your Google Discover traffic and other traffic sources that are engagement-based. Now, it only opens a couple times a year, but you can get on the interest list if you want to sign up for it. We go through all these strategies in detail to get a ton of Discover traffic to your site, or at least put you in the best position to do it, because it's Google, so it's always a little unpredictable, but we'll set you up as much as we can for success. So I'll put a link in the description, but in the meanwhile, if you're getting Discover traffic, then uh, you can at least see where it's coming from and what's going to in console, search console here.